Hi everyone, it's Jojo from Mojo Jojo Plants, and today I'm planning in my classic happy planner from February 26th to March 3rd. We're already going into our third month, whoop, whoop. Um, but I'm going to be going in with the Bohemian Bright sticker book because I haven't gotten to play with this one yet. I feel like I just have so many sticker books that I haven't even touched yet, um, but I'm going to go in with this one because the colors in here are probably some of my favorite, and I thought I could pair it with Lux Winter from Live Love Posh. There is this gorgeous set in here which I just love these color schemes it's probably uh, just gorgeous anyway so we're gonna go in with that and I think I can make it work pretty well um, with the colors in this book as well so let's go ahead and just dive right on in I accidentally bent this book backwards too far and now some of the pages are ripping out which was the point of doing the perforated things but I messed it up so don't do that I got too excited and I completely just like bent back the whole thing <laughs> I did it and then I was like oh no um anyway so I think I'm gonna put this long piece since I have this piece out I might as well try to use all these stickers right um but I'm gonna put this long piece over here on the edge so because I don't really ever use my sidebar area I don't have that much stuff going on anymore <laughs> Or at least I separate things enough to where I feel like I don't need, you know, stuff over there. So I'm going to go in and then I'm just going to trim off this little extra piece here. Um, yes, there we go. Ah, already so pretty. Um, and then I do have a flat piece on another page that we can use. So I'm going to stick this one up top over here, just right in the center, get that laid down. And then I'm going to go in with a quote from uh, this book. It's a nice giant quote, if I can get it out in one piece. We're going to pull this out and I feel like it just matches really well. That's why I was like, I feel like we can make these sets work perfectly. Okay, okay, so nice big quote over there, and I'm going to look for another quote to put on this side. I don't have a ton going on this week, so that's kind of why I'm like, oh, I can actually put, um, you know, I actually can put some things down and take up some space. So I'm just going to go in with a bunch of quotes, especially we have a rose gold foil on both of those, which is perfect. Um... Anyway, so I'm going to start putting in a couple of boxes in here. And now that I'm thinking of it, I feel like this purple that's in this one is a really good purple. Um, so I'm going to start putting in a couple things. This is Spring 2.0. Um, Friday is a release day. So I'm going to put a box in there so that way I can remember and have that kind of take up space of the fact that I know that Friday's a release day. Actually, both these two colors from the Spring 2.0 work perfectly. Like, those shades are spot on. Oh my gosh, that actually matches. <laughs> like, perfect. Um, anyway, okay, so I wrote a sticky note. There it is. Okay, so we have an appointment on Tuesday. Gotta renew. Well, we can't renew it. We have to get a new one. But we're getting another passport for the kiddo. Um, because she's going on a trip with us and then that way she has it because my husband just loves going out of the country so <laughs> want to make sure I get that in there um, and then I have an appointment on Thursday just kidding I don't have an appointment on Thursday my appointments on get back Wednesday looking at the wrong day here okay and then I think I'm gonna use these lighter pink boxes which if I have any I don't even know if I have any started using them. okay Whew. and I'm gonna put in things for Nay's therapy just so I have them in here and then you know that again just kind of takes up some space and helps me fill in because I have to do these Monday through Thursday so it just kind of helps my brain to know that I have those in here and all taken care of so I'm going to do the light pink for her stuff. 
Okay, and then I think that's really it. The only other thing I have is I have dance on Sunday. So I am just going to add another box for Sunday. But other than that, functional wise, like I don't think I need a lot this week. We have Tuesday's appointment, Wednesday's, Thursday's pre-order, but I don't need to worry too much. I know I'll know that. And then release day. Yeah. Okay. So I have the major, I have the major to do's in here. I think I am going to add like maybe like one checklist, one or two checklists, and we'll do the little babies. Because I think the little babies help me. Even though you can take the big sizes and cut them down and, you know, use as many as you want. But I just, I know myself, and I feel like every time I do a long checklist, I always feel guilty when I don't fill in everything for that whole checklist. I don't know. I don't know why I'm, I'm, I'm like, why am I like this? I don't know. <laughs> so I'm just going to put a couple of those in there. Okay. So I think functional wise, we're good. And now I do want to go in with more of the boho stuff because we haven't even really gotten anything from in here. And I do want to add some of these gorgeous full boxes. So we're going to just go in and start adding in some of these I'm going to try to find some of the different colors I definitely want to pull in more of the blue because now we have a lot of the purple and the pink which is great um but I do want to get some more of this blue color in here because it is really pretty and these aren't normal classic size or like vertical size I know the planner that these were for are a little bit different but something to keep in mind Again, I'm just trying to get some more of this blue in here. So I'm looking in this book and just pulling out blue accents. Because I feel like that'll help get some of this blue in here. Sorry, I keep like changing my mind of where I want to put things. Um, I have this giant blue crush it. Like, sounds good. <laughs> that in there. We have some of these blue flowers. I'm actually going to cut this one in half or close enough to in half I guess. Get some of this in here. And we will be going in with the little posh flowers too. I just want to get more of the blue accent specifically from this book. Um, ooh, we have some words that say checklist. And then the blue, which I'm like, that's nice. Can you help me get some more of that blue in here? Doing some layering. This book is just really pretty. like looked at the time to relax sticker and laughed in my head <laughs> I don't do that that much I'm I get too restless sometimes it's really hard for me to like take a chill pill um so I'm just gonna pull out some more of these florals because these florals are pretty and these books go together so stinking well um, I actually think I'm going to lay that down. I should have just cut it. But I'm just going to take my X-Acto knife and gently cut that off so it stops at the line. And then I'm going to put the rest over on this side. I love making my florals stretch a little bit more. Then I don't have to use as many. And then I can hoard them for a longer time. Everybody wins. Uh, these colors some of my favorite colors together so pretty okay I'm trying to decide what I want more of <laughs> again I'm just trying to get more of this like blue in here 
this blue is just really pretty. All the blue accents. We even have these stickers, which on this page you can't really see what they are until you pull them up. But they're just like little page flag stickers. And then just add some of those. Uh, <laughs> I think it's pretty. I just love these colors together. Like I feel like you can't go wrong with these colors. Purple, pink, and blue. Just gorgeous colors together. Just getting a little bit more of that foil in there because it's already in here, so might as well add a little bit more. Okay, I think that's good. So let's go ahead and get this set up because we are going to figure out how we're going to lay this out. I'm trying to figure out, I think I'm going to do purple. I don't think I have, I mean, I think I have a dark blue. Let me figure out what color background we want and then we'll get this set up to take our picture. Okay, so I'm so glad I looked because I couldn't remember if I had a like darker blue background, but I had a dark blue like cardboard, cardstock thing, whatever these are called. I don't even no um but I feel like this is good because I've been trying to pull out that blue this whole time so I feel like that's a good book to pull out um but I'm gonna go ahead and start sticking these books in here just so that way I have them somewhat close by for the photo I feel like white beads are the vibe there's not really I don't think there's really there's like no black in this spread at all so definitely think white beads are the way to go. I thought about black, but I was like, no, there's no black in here like at all, which is so weird because I love having black, <laughs> black stickers in here, but I don't have any. So I'm just going to start laying things in some spots. I have my little name tag. Okay. I'm trying to figure out if there's anything else anything else that I want to add I don't really think this one needs a lot and I don't have anything close by to add I'm like trying to like look around to see <laughs> what I have I have a couple pens as I drop all of them these are the click art pens so I'm just pulling out some colors that I have in here I can pull out I don't know if I'll be able to see that when I take the picture but we're gonna try we'll see how it goes okay so let me take the picture and then we will evaluate all right and here is how the photo came out I feel like that was super quick and easy and ugh, I just love this spread I think just the colors are just what I needed today. Um, but there we go. Super simple today, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give a thumbs up and subscribe, and I hope I'll see you in my next one. Bye!